good YouTube, it's your boy LB. I know, I know I haven't been like vlogging, I've been busy. No excuse though, I'm back. Uh, I'm just about to take y'all with me right now. I'm about to go to the car wash, then um, I gotta go to the store, grab some things. But before I even get started, li listen, listen, listen. I get more views from my non-subscribers than subscribers. So right somewhere down here, there's a like button, I mean a subscribe button. Subscribe to this video, turn post notifications on, right? I ain't gonna lie to y'all. These videos are getting tougher day by day. Like it's day 22, going hard, like going, I don't know how to describe it, bro, but it's like, it's hard, like uploading consecutively. I respect all YouTubers after this. Like I said, day 30, my day, my uh, 30 day special. I got a big announcement, so stay tuned for that. One thing you guys go notice about these vlogs is I wash my car like three times a week. Like I think right now, yo, I think I'm stuck. I think I'm stuck, like I'm not moving, I'm not, I am not, I repeat, I repeat, this is not a drill, this is not a drill. I am not moving in the car wash, I think I am stuck. Someone said, help, look, he's stuck, I'm stuck, the things ain't moving, the things ain't wishy-washy, I think I'm stuck. This is not a drill, this is not a drill. Yo. Yo, he's not moving. The little spinny things ain't wishy. Oh, never mind. We, we good. We good. We good. All right. What's good? What's good? What's good with y'all? Um, the other day I asked on my Instagram, Twitter, and Snapchat to ask me some questions. I got a lot on Instagram and Snapchat. Um, not really much on Twitter. So the first question I got is the question is who are your top five favorite artists right now? Um, I'll say Nipsey, Kendrick, G Perico. Um, Faz put me on an 8 Boogie. Um, then my fifth one, I'll say Dave East. Top five, top five. No, AZ Trike, AZ Trike, AZ Trike, AZ Trike. That's my top five, that's my top five. The next question is, how do you be filming for all of the big YouTubers or slash influencers? Um, to be completely real with you, um, honestly, just working, just working, being at the right place, right time and um, not being like starstruck, you know what I'm saying? Not letting, uh, not letting the, uh, who the person is, like, oh shit, like, it's Odell Beckham or it's Drewski, just like, just, like regular, a regular person too, they just got more status to their name, more money. So you know, just being regular, stuff like that. Who's one person you'd like to shoot a video for and or make a YouTube video with? Um, the person I want to shoot a video for is Roddy Rich or Kendrick. I feel like I can do something dope with that. Um, YouTube video wise, who I want to shoot for, um, uh, I'll have to say Flight, Flight Reacts. Well, yeah, I'll say Flight, Flight, hands down, just cause he's funny. I just want to hoop, just do a 1v1 with him. It's, okay, this is, this is a good one, this is a good one. How do you stay so motivated slash dedicated even when you don't feel like doing anything? Um, My boy Faz basically broke it down to me. He's like, motivation comes in like spurts. You feel me? Like you can be motivated, like people be motivated to go to the gym, right? But how long does that motivation last? Like, like you think about it, when people go to the gym, think about it, hold on, think about it. Um, New Year's resolution, everyone just they wanna get fit, right? If you go to the gym, like around New Year's time, New Year's, January, February, you, that gym is packed. The, as the months go on, you see it, die, it dies down. Every single year that I've been going to the gym. Always like that, right? People are motivated to go to the gym. Why? New Year's resolutions, right? The difference between motivation and dedication is dedication, um, how to explain it, is like, you're more dedicated to your craft, you're more dedicated to do something to get you to the next level. You're more, de dedication, last last longer than motivation like motivation comes with spurts dedication it lasts last longer you know what i'm saying so um how i stay dedicated to my craft is uh i just i have a strong why like why i do this right um i'm not gonna go too much in detail about it but like i know why i do this and what i want to accomplish and so i get it it's like i, I can't stop you feel me so that's how I stay motivated and dedicated. It might be different for some people, but I know for me personally, like why I do what I do, why I be staying up late as hell, you know what I'm saying? 
Um, that's a good question. That's definitely a good question. Next question, do you have a girlfriend? If not, what is your type? Um, currently, no. I do not have a girlfriend. Um, my type, um, to be real, I want a girl that can match my hustle, I don't match me. Because like me, at the end of the day, I'm gonna go, I'm gonna do what I gotta do to make sure that I'm good. You know what I'm saying? I don't want a girl that's like, a leech or like just leeching on me, like making sure that like I'm doing everything. Like if you ain't bringing nothing to like the table, like why, like why you with me? You feel me? So that's why like I feel like right now I'm like single. What are some influences in your life that um, helped you shape who you become today? Um, influence. Um, the big, the big one, I would say like hands, like hands down, um, like. Undoubtedly, like, undoubtedly, like, influence would be my cousin Keontae. Um, if it wasn't for him, you guys wouldn't, um, you guys wouldn't be getting this video right now, right? Um, just say back then, I was, I was weird. I was smart, I was smart as hell, but I was like weird, you know what I'm saying? But, um, he made me like, he helped me like change my ways. Um, him, my mom, my grandma, my boy Frank, Terrell, Memphis. There's like a lot that influenced me. Nipsey Hustle's a big one. Like, hands down, Nipsey Hustle's like the biggest one that uh, helps me, like, is a big influence. Um, I can go on and on, but if you look at my Instagram, Twitter, even this series, it's called The Marathon, right? I can go on and on about it, but him, uh, my boy Fast, CEO, everyone in like the RPS, you know what I'm saying? Big influences. It's, it's a lot, you know what I'm saying? But it's a lot of influence. The next question was, um, did you play sports in high school and has that had any impact on you today? Um, I played football and basketball in high school. Um, I was easily motivated to like go work. Um, go work when I played basketball. Um, there was times where um, I text my mom because she used to work the night shift. I just text my mom like, because she used to work at 10, get off at like 5 or 6, right? So I text her like, yo, when you get home, wake me up. So she would get off, wake me up, and I'll just go get shots up right before school. So five, six in the morning, getting the shots up, practicing my ball handling, all that type of stuff. Shower, catch the buzz, go to school. You know what I'm saying? I was doing that like every single day. Um, then with then football help too, because uh, still to this day, I felt like it helped me fine tune my um, work ethic. Me and my boy Frank, um, so we, junior year, uh, we felt like, we just felt like we wasn't given like the respect that like we, we deserved, right? So me and him was like, yo, we just about to fuck off season. Like say like the season ended, say the season, so the season ended, let's say November, right? We took a week off, we're like, fuck what everyone else is doing, we just about to go hard at this shit, you know what I'm saying? So we took a week off after the season ended, went home from November, all the way to fucking the next, the next football season, right? We just going at it. I'm talking like, me and him was waking up at five in the morning, five in the morning, uh, doing football drills, lifting at his house, um, going to school, mind you, this is the winter time. So winter time in Arizona, it's pitch black, it's cold as hell. There would be times me and his hands be frozen, be numb. You feel me? Like I'm talking about like frozen, our hands is like frozen, like fat as hell. And we have our hands in our, in our shorts, like yo, like, Yo, like, we need to, like, hurry up, get your reps in, bro, because I'm trying to go inside, whatever, right? Do that, 5 or 6 o'clock in the morning. Um, I, I, drive, I drive to school, so uh, shower, just kick it for a bit, drive to school. We have this athletic performance class, so basically another practice, you know, basically another training. So be in that class, do another training. Mind you, we trained before. And then um, after school, we had another training. Um, they had a thing, it's like this little program. We go to that. Then after that, we'd have to double back, go to um, our seven on seven practice. Uh, set, set changed my life for real. Uh, we have to go there, seven on seven practice, doing things. Then um, go from set practice to my cousin AB's house because we all live on the same street. Work out with him. Don't get done until like 12, 12, 11 o'clock at night. Still doing homework, wake up, repeat it. We're talking about like every single day, like every single day nonstop. And, uh, I just hope, I just hope my, uh, been my, 
uh, work ethic right there. So um, this last question. So what's next after these 30 days? What do you have next compared for the marathon? The marathon's not gonna stop. Like I said, like it's not gonna stop. It's, it's still, it's, I'm still gonna keep doing these videos. Um, during these, like these doing these videos for like the past, what, 22, 23 days, um, just showed me that like, yo, I can do this YouTube. I was gonna wait till day 30 to make an announcement that like, yo, I'm about to do this YouTube shit full time, like start dropping it. But like, if you stay to this point in the video, you just know that I'm doing YouTube, like I'm going hard at it. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm not gonna be uploading every day, but this is gonna be, I'm gonna have a schedule. I'm gonna have upload multiple videos a week, right? We're just gonna run it up, we're just gonna run it up, run it up from there. So, um, Marathon don't stop, it's gonna keep going. I'm still gonna bring these videos, still taking y'all with me. I'm still gonna be vlogging and all that type of stuff. Um, but that's that. I appreciate y'all watching this video. Um, appreciate y'all watching this video. Um, just like, comment, share, and subscribe, and uh, I'll see y'all tomorrow.